So most of my research right now focuses on children with a genetic disorder called Fragile X Syndrome. It's the most common inherited form of intellectual disability. It's passed on through carrier parents who don't really know that most parents who are carriers don't know that they're carriers. And so they think that they've given birth to a typical child, um, and it's only after two or three years that they uh, find out that their child has Fragile X. So we've been studying the early development of children with Fragile X and looking at ways to identify them earlier. Early development is important. The early years of life are important for all children, but we feel that for children with disabilities, it's especially important that they be identified early so that they can get the help that they need to maximize development and to uh, promote a good quality of life, and also to get families the supports that they need so that they can um, cope with having a child with a disability. Children with um, genetic disorders, often those conditions are hidden. And parents go through a long, what we call a diagnostic odyssey, trying to find out what's wrong with their child. So we want them to help make that diagnostic odyssey shorter. Uh, so one of the things I'm especially interested in is newborn screening. We found that families um, often go through this pretty tortuous process of um, taking their child to a, a physician and saying there's something wrong with my child and um, oftentimes being told, uh, well, he's a boy, he'll grow out of it, let's wait and see. And by the end of two or three years, parents are pretty upset about this process because they knew that something was wrong. Um, and so what we want to do is to help um, acknowledge family concerns earlier, validate them, and implement the kind of screening and testing programs that would help, uh, help make that process uh, quicker.